There's no such thing as work-life balance. None! Preparation. And I am, I practice one hour, at least one hour for every hour that I'm with you, I practice an hour before you got here. So I practice 50, 60 hours. And I could give this seminar in a coma. Literally in a fucking coma. Because I know your questions. They're all the same retarded, meathead questions. <laughs> and they're all based because you're afraid. False expectations appearing real. You're afraid, you know. It's the unknown you haven't done. Uh, I think three people asked him how he gets out of his fucking comfort zone. Okay, um, the, um, and you're not going to be, you know, some of the guys go and skydive and jump, you know, on, uh, you know, uh, bungee jumping, like stuff that I've done in recent years. But um, he, he's, he was afraid <coughs> of asking, see, before he had a big company behind him with a big balance sheet. That's a lot different. We've had guys from Goldman Sachs come in here and they, they piss their pants because they're not wearing the, the Superman Goldman Sachs shield and they never had to worry about the money there. Well, now he's, you know, now will they still say yes to me when I don't have, you know, the big company behind me? And, um, and now for those of you that have never been with a big company, never had a big balance sheet, you don't know, but it, 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 I've never really had that either. So, but he is going out there, he's pressing the flesh with people that would normally um, say no. But contrary to what you believe, or what you think, or what your in-laws told you, not that many people are out there asking.